The Bolin is one of the most popular knots in sailing because it holds well and is quick to tie and untie. This silver Dyneema it's tied in is also very popular because it's very lightweight and stronger than steel cable. But like every superhero that has a weakness, Dyneema has a weakness too. It's very slippery and knots can pull right out, to the point that some say you should never tie a Bolin in Dyneema, and if you do, terrible things will happen to you and your boat. So I decided to strength test a Dyneema bowline to prove or disprove this myth once and for all. I tied a Dyneema bowline around the lower bar of this 3-ton hydraulic car jack, and then tied a round turn and a bunch of half hitches around the upper bar. As I apply tension, the knot begins to squirm, and it looks like the bowline might just pull out. But it actually looks like the bowline is setting, while the half hitches are continuing to squirm. The braking strength of this 3 16 or 5mm Dyneema is 2.5 tons, so it will be interesting to see how close to that we can get. As I continue to apply tension, the bowline is still moving a bit, but not as much as earlier. It's getting really tight, and it's hard to apply pressure without the jack moving around too much. We're getting really close to the 2.5 ton braking strength of this Dyneema. The capacity of this jack is only 3 tons, so it's getting really hard to jack. That was the sound of the Dyneema braking at the upper end, where we have a couple of round turns and a bunch of half hitches. But the Dyneema bowlin at the bottom is still intact. I'm not entirely surprised by this test, as I've been using Dyneema bowlins on my boat for years with no ill effects, and not a single one has broken or slipped. It's not to say it can't happen, but it never has on my boat, and not even in my high-tech basement laboratory. So go ahead, tie yourself a bowlin in Dyneema, if you dare. Or better yet, Impress your friends by learning to tie one behind your back, like I do in the video linked above. And don't forget to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and watch this next video.